What's up guys, it's Rachel. You know, there aren't many things that I like about myself, but if I had to pick one thing, that'd be my smile. But the other day, I, it's kind of sad, but I noticed that my teeth are not as white as I want them to be. So I was like, no, no. And I looked into teeth whitening right away. If you guys watched my vlog already, you guys know that I already got my teeth whitened. Now this is after my treatment, so you guys are watching the final version of it. Let me tell you what happened. So I contact Soul Guide Medical because I trust them, they are the best. They always connect me to the right hospital or the right clinic for me. And so huge thank you to Soul Guide Medical again for helping me to get the best treatment that I could possibly ask for. Okay, now I'm sure you clicked on this video because you have probably a lot of questions about teeth whitening because I did too. I realized there have been there had been so many things that I kind of misunderstood about the whole process, which makes sense because this was literally my first time getting my teeth whitened in Korea. I mean, in everywhere. And I did have a lot of questions and now they are answered. <laughs> and I'm gonna share with you everything that I learned about teeth whitening in Korea. So without any further ado, let's get into it. For my teeth whitening, they connected me to Oak's Dental Clinic in Gangnam. And on my treatment day, I met up with Tony from Soul Guide Medical and he checked the color of my teeth, which was kind of awkward, but he was really nice about it too. And I asked Tony a very important question. Well, I wanted to get them done that day. So the question was, can I get it done today? If I walk in, can anyone get the treatment right then and there? And here's his answer. If you want to get whitening, your gum condition has to be stable. Mm -hmm. If your gum condition is not stable, we first have to clean your teeth, wait a week, and then we can whiten. If the gum condition is good enough, we can do the whitening today. One week of flossing and your gum can flossing and brushing correctly, and your gums get much better. So Tony gave me a tip uh, more than a week ago to floss well, and let's see how I did it. Yeah. <laughs> And then we went into panoramic CT scanning room to check my teeth. And I met my dentist. He explained the overall status of my teeth by looking at the CT scan. And on number 5 and 7, so it would be 5 and 7, mm -hmm. you have cavities. Apparently, mm -hmm. I had a couple of cavities. Ah. Uh, more on that later in this video, so stay tuned. Before getting the whitening treatment, I need to get a scaling first, which is just a cleaning of my teeth. These are not in the best of conditions. It might hurt a bit and you might bleed. Looking a little bit cleaner, slightly whiter. They already look whiter right now. Okay, finally, it's time to get the whitening treatment. And I had a question. I hate the pain. Frankly, I was scared because I heard a lot of things about how painful it is. So I had to ask, is it painful? Am I gonna be in pain? You might get a sensation like a sharp like sting, like, like that inside the tooth. It can happen during the procedure and maybe until tomorrow. But if it comes, it just comes for a half a second. You mean shooting through pain? Yeah, in a tooth like this. Okay. But it's really short and doesn't happen too often. I was also curious that the reason why it hurts so bad is because your gum is damaged. Well, it's true that I want them to be wider than now, but it doesn't mean that I want them to be damaged. I didn't want them to be weak because of teeth whitening. And then I was also curious just how often I need to get this um, to maintain the level that I am gonna achieve today. Every two years, basically whenever you feel uh -huh. that you want to touch up. Well, it's been about two years. Yeah. Uh, I think they're still fairly white, so I don't 
want to do it right now, but I might do it again, maybe a year. How do you maintain your teeth so clean? I don't drink cola or coffee too much, and mm -hmm. when I do, I drink it through a straw. Okay. Coffee drinkers okay. and smokers, uh, their teeth tend to darken the most. Mm -hmm. Okay, and then we talked about different levels of tooth color because I was curious where I was and if I get the treatment today, just how much I can be improved. Like to what extent can they get whitened <laughs> was my question. So A1, A2, that's really natural. That's what we're born with. Mm -hmm. B1 is a bit wider. I'm around A1, B1 level. Uh -huh. Also, I was curious about Korean celebrities level. When I look at them, their teeth are perfect and pretty white. So yeah, if I'm getting the treatment today, I want to know if I can get them, like if I can get to their level. Uh, celebs can go maybe B2. B2. Uh, maybe a little bit wider, but around this shade, it looks pretty white in a human mouth. <laughs> if it takes well, you might even be around a little bit of A1. A1? Okay, this is something we all need to keep in mind. This is very important. Is there any food item that I need to avoid after the getting the treatment? <laughs> and then we started the treatment. <laughs> okay, you're gonna look like a shark. <laughs> I'm gonna be talking with my hands. Alright. <laughs> This is not an actual laser. It's called laser whitening. That's just what people uh, know it as. But it's not an actual laser. It's a special kind of light. And we use a special agent that's placed on the tooth. The light activates the agent on the teeth and that makes your teeth white. I had to wait for 20 minutes under the machine. That was honestly a lot. Not gonna lie, because I'm being really honest here. And then they gave me two sets. So in total, I was lying on that chair for 40 minutes. I mean, it's not painful, but it was so boring. I was bored. After what it felt like an eternity. Finally, it was time to see the result. Not being able to talk was the hardest part. <laughs> Ah, surprise, surprise! I reached a 1.5 ish level, which is super awesome considering where I started. Mine actually got wider than we aimed for. I reached to Korean Celeste level. Yeah, that's about A1. A1. Smile. Ha! Ah, now, it was time to talk about the cavities. Uh, not again! Not again, Rachel! Come on! Actually, I'm going back to the clinic literally tomorrow. Tony explained to me I have cavities on number 5 and 7 here. And originally, I had a amalgam. And that's broken. Duh. And it gets worse. There's a cavity inside. You have a couple of cavities. Mm -hmm. What you're going to have done is called an onlay. There's actually a little piece in there. Mm -hmm. And that's the piece we're going to create from a block like this. What we're going to do is we're going to dig out all of the bad material. Mm -hmm. You have bad material on the inside. We're going to scoop all of that out. Mm -hmm. And then we're going to customize a, a filling here. She's going to have a couple of these made. Well, they can be fixed with only. It's like half a crown and they are tooth color restorations. I don't know how painful it's gonna be. Hopefully not much. Hey, Tony is here. Hello, everybody. Oh, it's okay. So, 
Like many years ago when I had, they injected a shot into my gum to make it numb. Yes. Is that what I am going through today? Yes, this is necessary. Yes? Yes. yes. Oh my god! This is probably the worst part of getting some oh my restoration god. done. Oh my god! So, <laughs> how to do that? My advice is that if you don't want to have this anesthesia needle going into your face, you should take really good care of your teeth by brushing 30 minutes after you eat and flossing at least once a day. And if you don't do that, you'll have to come see me, which I don't think is such a bad thing, but uh, you, oh might, you might have dental fears as she does. Hey, you know what? It's not one shot. It's like multiple shots. If I remember correctly, at least three shots go in. But really, it's the first shot that you tend to feel more than the others because as soon as the first shot goes in, it numbs the area. That so, is so painful. <laughs> yeah, it's not fun. So again, my advice, brush your teeth and floss. Oh my god. Okay. Uh, Alright. Uh, um, I don't know if I will ever recover from this. You ready? Oh my god. Uh, are you going in now? Yeah. Oh my god. Oh my god, wish me luck. Oh You'll yeah. be fine. I don't think. But the good thing is that if you catch the cavities on time, you can fix them. You ready? Yeah. Okay, hang uh, on. Oh, okay. okay. Uh, where are you going? I'm gonna, <laughs> like, be with, I'm gonna be with you, don't worry. I, I'm not leaving, I'll, okay. be, I'll be next to her the whole time. I'm paying the price for my lazy days. <laughs> So it didn't hurt as much as you thought, right? Yeah. Dr. Bae has a special type of technique where the way he injects it, number one, hurts less, and two, he doesn't need as many injections mm. to get you numbed up. Mm. Uh, he studied this technique for a long time and it's what makes him one of the best. He's always trying to self-improve, but uh, I'm pretty sure it didn't hurt nearly as much as you imagined. <laughs> But it's like iffy. Oh, Here wow, we go. Well done. Usually they make us, make me to come back next week or something to make it at a different lab. But they make it here themselves. They got the machine. But by hand is where he shapes it. Mm -hmm. So he'll come in, he'll shape it and then color it to try to match your tooth color and then that's it and then it has to be put in okay thank you
Yeah. After they removed all the filling and they are removing all the cavity, we made the two restoration. Can you see this one? After removing all the filling, Amazon, so we replaced with the only. And after removing all the cavity, we replaced with the only. Yeah, yeah. Once a day. Once a day is enough. Oh my god. Thank you so much, Tori. Okay. Okay, I don't know what happened, but this is the outro. Assuming that you all saw the treatment, as of now, as of tomorrow, my teeth are in the perfect state ever. I want to keep it that way. What I need to do is, of course, avoiding colored food also <sighs> I can't stress this enough Rachel and I'm telling this to myself and you guys too floss every day floss every day okay ah let's do it um, huge thank you to Tony and Soul Guide Medical Team for finding me the best treatment. If you also want to contact Soul Guide Medical, you can find them at counsel at soulguidemedical.com and you can also contact the clinic right away at oakstentalclinic at gmail.com and of course I'm gonna leave all the information in the description box so you can check them out. And that is all. Thank you so much for watching and I'll see you in the next one. Peace out, love you, and goodbye.